Okay, so this is another settlement video. I wanted to get away from Starlight Driving for a bit, so decided to do something with Hangman's Alley. And yeah, it's okay. I wanted to make it look kind of more wastelandy, a little bit more like a Bethesda created settlement, you know, have that vibe to it. Whereas I like to generally make quite polished settlements. This is a more sort of, oh, I don't know. Like I say, wastelandy feel. And um, this particular little room, by the way, I was irritated that I couldn't scrap, so I didn't really bother doing much with it. Just some kind of cursory decoration. But the rest of it's alright. Um, and uh, I actually had a lot of trouble trying to work out what I wanted to do with this settlement. I knew I wanted to use a little bit of. Um, just a little bit of uh, scaffolding to build up walkways and stuff like I have. Um. But I really, you know, I was struggling. I didn't know how I wanted the garden to be and that kind of thing. But I'm fairly happy with the result. It's only got a few buildings in it. And this is a short video, I think, I want to say. Um, so, first thing I'm going to talk about is Voltec Workshop. That's coming out on the 26th of this month. I'm hoping I can... My plan is I'm going to do a like a, a Let's Build a Vault series where I'm just going to go in blind and try and build up a vault. Before that though, I'm going to... Uh, well, I guess if I want it to be blind... Okay, maybe that won't be blind. What I'm going to do at first is just mess around for a bit, get a feel for the objects. Um in the workshop and I'm going to do an overview or a bit, a bit of a re review of what I think of those things but then I'm going to do my playthrough and it's going to be I mean I'm not done with Far Harbor I'm not even close like jeez that's going to be a bit irritating but um, yeah I've watched the the live stream they did so I've seen the kind of stuff they've got going on um, I love the decoration, and I love the way the power works. is brilliant. Because um, I was really worried about having conduits everywhere and fucking wires. Um, because I, I don't like the new conduits we got. Uh, I'm going to do a video on them, I think, at some point. But I'm not a big fan. I don't think they really solve the problem. But this is a lot better, because you don't have to have wires everywhere. Um, the floors basically act like wires and, and you, you have little hubs on the walls that have a radius of power. It's, it's genius. So there's that. Um, but the decoration, the new posters, uh, the boxes, the statues, the Vault Boy and Vault Girl statues. Fucking love it. Love it, love it, love it. So I'm very excited for that. I think this is going to be possibly my favourite of any of the DLCs because... I've said this in a previous video, but when they announced Fallout 4 and they showed that there was going to be settlement building, one of the things I thought was like, well, vaults, surely, I mean, in a game about the post-apocalyptic uh, post -apocalyptic world where many people went into these safe havens called vaults, you would think that one of the things you'd be able to build would be a vault. And I understand why they've added it later on in the games uh, life cycle but um I yeah yeah I, they had added at some point and I'm, I'm glad they have I'm very very excited for that not too excited for Nuka World um we'll, we'll see I'm sure that's gonna add some more building stuff and I've heard like you can be a reader or whatever I don't know it's, it's interesting this little settlement here though uh I really it, this entrance gave me a lot of trouble because I was thinking, okay, do I want a guard tower here? You know, some kind of defensible point. Instead, I just... Oh, sorry. I made a little farm area. And that's also where I put the switch for the gate. Um, I didn't... I used basic generators for this. I thought about maybe having a generator area with one of the uh, big ones, but... Nah, I just used the basic one, several of them, because again, I was going for that kind of very, you know, like this is a settlement built by people who don't really know what they're doing, and 
it's this trial and error, and it's 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 just a bit sort of um, scrappy and and wastelandy, and I, I think I think it's pretty cool. I, I think it it turned out fairly well um, for what it is. It, it could be better. I did decorate this one with a bit more junk than the the, the ones at Starlight Drive-In, which, by the way, I will come back to. Um, but for now, I think, you know, I'm going to put out some more Overwatch videos. Maybe a, a video on the Conduits, like I said, some more of my Far Harbor playthrough. And I also want to do a settlement tour on... Spectacle Island with my giant fortress, which I need to finish. Um, but I, <laughs> I don't know what I even want to do with that. But yeah, that's been the video. Um, so I hope you enjoyed. Uh, just you know, talking about some of what is to come. Um, in the future. I quite like what I did it with the outside because I noticed with the previous uh, settlement videos I didn't really do a lot with the outside area so I might go back to that. But here I put down a lot of crap and, and sort of made it a bit, like, give it a bit more life. Um, and it, it turned out fairly well. So yeah, look out in the future for some some more settlement videos and some more cool stuff. Definitely looking forward to the vault -Tec Workshop. But until such a time as I make one of those videos, I will just say... T-T-F-N.